It's amazing how gentle Louis plays with them. I yeah, mean, he, he, he won't play with us that gentle. <laughs> okay, you've got Louis, the Great Dane Hound mix here. He's right at maybe a year, year and a half old. Uh, an older couple in their 90s adopted him from animal control, and he was obviously too much dog for them. So we get the call that we've got, you know, a jumbo breed dog coming in and see if we have room for him. And he's came in and, as you can see, his best friend is a 12-pound Jack Russell. And, uh, <laughs> That's awesome. He'd be good with a family with maybe early teenage kids. Somebody can get out and run with them or the fear of him not pushing them over is there. Now, how do you try out dogs to see who gets along? What, what's the method to introduce them? Is there? Yeah, yeah, there's a, at first you want to do it on leash and watch for aggressive signs. You know, see if you can get some, one of the dogs to do the famous play bow. If you can do that, then drop leashes, let them play for a minute and see if they can get comfortable around each other. Well, this right here is Clyde. He's some form of hound mix. He's probably a little under a year old. He's a little crazy. He likes to run around and bounce and uh, gets along with everybody. He loves people, loves dogs. He's a lot of fun. He's funny to watch sometimes. He's real goofy. Real good dog. Yeah. You know, right, Clyde. And uh, he's got the funny t head tilt. His head kind of leans to the side. He's not yeah, the, the most coordinated, but he's cute. Wasn't there a dog, dog here that had a head tilt? Dizzy, my first dog. That's yeah, cool. yeah. <laughs> Fix your ear, Clyde. He's mad at me. I cleaned his ears this morning. What is it, buddy? Yeah, I don't care how bad the day is. You get on the phone or you get some bad news or whatever. You can go in and pet a dog and you'll calm down. You watch two dogs play, you can't help but to smile. I think because at the end of the day, that's who you can count on, right? That's how I feel when I come home. Right. And I've had the worst day. Right. And my guys are just like, oh my God, you're yeah. here. Do you guys feel the same? Like when you go to court and you come back and it's oh, like. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Mia is a year and a half old boxer mix. She is extremely sweet and loves to play. She's had a little bit of bad luck in going to homes that weren't the best match for her. She's still a puppy and it's been older people that she's went to and she uh, wasn't the best mix. She probably needs a home with maybe another puppy there, a couple kids to play with. Uh, this program's taught me a lot about just people skills because we have a common goal in here and that's to get these dogs out. And if you know, we're not working together, if we're stressed out, the dogs aren't going to work with us and they're going to be stressed out too. It just doesn't work. This is Hector. He's probably a year old lab mix and uh, is the happiest dog in the world. He, you know. Oh, what are you qu flopping around? You know, when a dog you, needs a belly rub, you've right, got to stop everything. Right. Yeah, as you can see, he just wants to be petted. He wants to cuddle. He wants to play. Uh, extremely sweet. This is a guy who whole body wiggles when he wags his tail. Is he pup? Is he puppy? <coughs> What's that? He's young. Yeah, he's about a year. What are we doing, Hector? I think he's ready for his home. Yeah, he's definitely ready to go. Don't eat my microphone. Oh, that's what he's asking. <laughs> Hector's real athletic. He likes to get out, run, and play. He'll run some agility. He'll chase the ball. Yeah, I've been here the longest, so I orientate all the new guys, kind of give them a little guidance on how to deal with their dogs. Tell me about this guy right here. This is Odin. He's probably about a year old pit mix. He's uh, real sweet, loves to play, get along with most of the dogs in here. Loves to jump up in the bed, barrow his head under your neck. Good buddy. So does he like people and dogs? Yeah, he loves people. I don't think he's ever met a stranger. He's one of the dogs when a tour group comes in, we'll bring him in because he's going to wag his tail and lick everybody. You a good boy, Odin? Uh, you a good boy, Odin? Yeah, I am a good boy. <laughs> he looks like he likes to cuddle. He does. He, he will jump in the bed, get under the covers, and sleep nose to nose with you if you'll let him.